Hello all. Welcome to this session. In this session, I am going to answer software testing interview question 318. That is, what is globalization testing? Let me answer. So what is globalization testing? Globalization testing is a type of testing where we check whether the given application is working globally. Okay, it should not work only in one region. The application has to work in different countries, regions and all those stuff. That's what is called as globalization. Okay, what is globalization? The application. Okay, let's say the application is developed in United States, but the application has to still work in India. Okay, if it is a supported region for that particular application as part of globalization, the application has to also work in India. Okay, in other countries also. Okay. So globalization testing is a type of testing where we check whether the given application is working globally. That is independent of its geographical and cultural environment. Okay, Indian culture is different. Uh, United States culture is different. Okay, geographically Indian uh, the languages that we speak in India are different. The language that we speak in United States is different. Like it has the application has to work globally guys. Okay, the application should contain the options. Okay, for the user to select so that it works globally okay in simple words testing the application which is developed for multiple languages is known as globalization testing okay in simple words if i have to explain this particular statement okay testing the application which is developed for multiple languages see only one application will be there but you will be given an option you'll be provided with an op option in the application where you can choose the language of your region or locality Okay, so that you, uh, the application can be globalized. Okay, that's how the application is globalized by the company which is producing it. So where the end users are given an option to select the language or whatever it is. Okay, language uh, according to their region or uh, geographical region or culture and environment, they can select the language and use the application according to their needs. Okay, for example, okay. Amazon.com. Okay, let's go to Amazon.com guys. I'll show you how the, how it is globalized. Okay. Let's go to Amazon.com. Okay, if I go to Amazon.com, guys, here by default, United uh, States uh, uh, flag is there and English language is selected. But uh, you see, what if uh, Portuguese? Okay, Portuguese. Okay, if uh, the region related to Portuguese language has to use application, simply select the Portuguese option, and you see everything will appear in Portuguese. Okay, everything is in Portuguese language now. Okay, again, if you want to change it to English, you can change it to English, guys. Okay. So not here here change it back to English uh, so a lot of other languages uh, Dutch language Spanish uh, if you want if, if the locality people of uh, span okay who speak Spanish language want to use the application they can change this application to Spanish that's how this amazon.com is uh, 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 is there globally okay it's globally available it's not only for the uh, people who who just speak English but also for the people who who can use application who doesn't know English, but who can uh, who are very comfortable with the different languages, right? They can use and this is how this application is globalized. This is how this application is globalized guys. So this is what is global uh, and testing such kind of applications to see whether uh, those options are working properly. Okay, uh, when you change to Portuguese or uh, Spanish or whatever it is uh, with proper uh, UI and proper language proper place where the text is being this uh, the Portuguese language text is being displayed all those things need to be tested as part of globalization testing okay so whether the application is globally supportable or not okay so here we don't have to we don't just test the application only in English language but also all supported languages we have to select and test the application multiple times you have to test the same application in different languages okay that's what is globalization testing guys so hope guys you understood what is globalization testing in this session. So that's all for this session in the next session. I'm going to answer another software testing interview question for you till then see you bye bye.